All right, here we are in Marlboro, New Jersey. We removed a 550 gallon tank about two weeks ago. We're back today to remediate the soils. I don't think it's gonna be a lot of soil that's coming out. We're estimating about one truckload triaxle, which is holding about roughly 25 tons of soil. So we gotta have the subsurface evaluator come out. He's gonna oversee us excavating the soil out to determine how far we have to dig. And then once we get to a clean zone, we're gonna take our post excavation samples and backfill with certified clean fill. We should have this all wrapped up by two, three o'clock this afternoon. soil remediation is we're going to take the overburden that's on top of where the tank was located so that's all clean material typically okay so we're going to take that material we're going to separate it we're going to get down to the plastic because on the day we pulled the tank and we knew that it was leaking we, we lined the hole with plastic and put the clean overburden on top of it so now when we come back we want to separate that clean overburden okay to minimize cost for disposal so we, we separate it like you see here in this pile we get down to the plastic and then at that point, that's when we're gonna start excavating the contaminated soil onto a truck so we can dispose of it off site. So that's what we're about to do now. And then once we get to a clean zone, we'll start taking our post excavation samples. So you need a total of five samples since this is a 550 gallon tank. He's gonna take his post excavation samples. They all look clean. Hopefully they field screen clean. And then we can start backfilling the excavation. Certified clean fill, we're back in the truck in here. It's a little bit tight getting between the house and the tree. And uh, we're gonna scoop out of the back of the truck because there's nowhere to dump the material. We can't directly dump into the excavation. So we'll just back them up now. Wrapping up here in Marlboro, New Jersey, soil remediation. One day, we're in and out. We showed up around 8.30 this morning. It's one o'clock in the afternoon. It's about one load, about 25 tons roughly, of contaminated soil that we had to remediate and then replace with certified clean fill. We took our post-tech samples. They were all screening really low on the PID. So we are pretty confident that the post-tech samples will come back from the lab all below the cleanup criteria, which is great. We'll get these clients a no further action letter from the state, typically within three to four weeks from today. Uh, the final remedial action report will be ready in two weeks, which is very efficient. They're closing on this property, so they need to move quickly with all the documentation and get this thing to the closing table. So they're very happy with the outcome. Small remediation today. Uh, they're not all big, so here's a perfect example of a, of a small remediation, about 25 tons of soil. So that's it. We'll see you on the next one.